In the lead-up to tomorrow's World Cup final against Australia, some have suggested New Zealand might be daunted by the sheer size of the MCG. But the co-hosts made themselves quickly at home at the venue that will host around 90,000 fans for the World Cup playoff. It is the first time in the 40-year history of the World Cup that New Zealand has reached the final, but their inspirational captain says his team isn't intimidated. I'm sure some guys will be nervous tomorrow morning, um, but you know, I think there's a sense of excitement um, about what we're going to be able to, about us going out there tomorrow and, and pitting our skills against the best in their backyard. So but it certainly whets the appetite and creates the greatest stage that we can ask for. So you know, tomorrow is uh, going to be a special day. The rival captains and good friends met for a handshake, a chat and an up-close look at the prize they will be fighting for tomorrow. Then the Australia captain produced the first surprise of the final by revealing it will be his last appearance in the one-day gold of his country. Um, I think it's the right time for, for me and the Australian cricket team. I'm, like I say, I was very fortunate four years ago to get the opportunity to captain this, this one-day team and I think that... That was really good preparation for me leading up to this World Cup and I think the next Australian captain deserves the same opportunity. Uh, I don't think it's realistic that I'll be here, I'll be fit and healthy for the next um, and available to, to play the next World Cup, so I believe it's the right time. But Australia's focus very clearly remains tomorrow's final and while the Black Caps will field an unchanged lineup, the home team won't be finalised until tomorrow. Spirits are high in the Australia camp with all 15 members of their squad fit and in form. Even the coach couldn't resist rolling back the years and a three-time World Cup winning legend of the game was on hand to share his wisdom. If the occasion needs any extra significance, the captain's one-day farewell has provided it. But at the day's end, the story of this World Cup will be written by the captain that lifts the trophy tomorrow evening.